Hey, what is going on guys? It's Shadow Gamer here and welcome back to the main channel where today guys um, For the first time ever we are going to be starting a career another career mode while doing The Shadow FC one so Shadow FC will still be going and everything like that But alongside this Tottenham career mode too So this is the team we've got at the moment. We need to sign a cam because We haven't got one so Steven Bergwijn's there at the moment. A striker would be good, just for now, while Dame Scarlet works to get his stats up. A winger, although we don't really need one. Definitely a defender. Maybe I'll go for a goalkeeper too. Because there's no way I'm keeping Galini in the team forever. So, striker, we're going to ignore for now. Midfielder-wise, we're going to go for... Um, we're going to scout up Ward Prowse, James Madison, Ericsson will look for Bale, we'll do that, approached by Brighton though, so if we want Bale we're going to have to go quickly for him, and Coutinho's at Villa, there's no way Sigelson will be joining us, and these are all strikers isn't it, yeah. So, Youth Academy-wise, we have got one player who's like, oh, we'll send him away. We have got one player, though, who is looking really good. And that's this guy, Jay Perkins. So, obviously, in the first Tottenham career mode, we had, we did, well, back in FIFA 20 now, um, we had, um, what was his name? Was it Patrice Belcourt? Was it Belcourt? I think it was Belcourt. Patrice Belcourt. What? Or is that... From the Shadow of Seeker mode? I think it was Belcourt. I think it was. And honestly, in... Shadow of FC, we've got... Um, Dane... Sc uh, not Dane Scarlet. Um, Carter Jarvis. So. We are dealing with a budget of 70 mil. So that will do us to bring to actually complete the sign in of two players who I definitely want to keep around. Christian Romero would we'll delegate that. And Kulewski. So we'll wait for that to come through. And when it does, we can then look to sign a midfielder. I will shortlist Rashford, but I'm not going to buy him. And I'm definitely not sending Son. Romero offer accepted. Bang, Christian Romero is a permanent Spurs player for us. He's a permanent player for us. And that now leaves... We're going to have no budget, so we are going to have to sell players. Let's see who we got out on loan. No, John, Saar, Gil, Ete, Parrot, Clark, Whiteman, and Bele. Although I don't really care, he can stay out on loan. Because, and Giovanni Lo Celso, who's already gone up and over all this season. Which is good. Hoybier, I actually... How much could we get for him? 37.54. We'll negotiate this. We'll try and get. I want. F let's try and go for. 48. 48? No. Maximum I would want 50. I don't understand how it's saying we could get 57 out of him. Kuliewski. Except that we're, we, we, we haven't got any money now to do that. Because Romero was so. Bloody expensive contract negotiations. Kulu, I can't, mate. I've got no money. I probably should have added a couple extra mil to it. Kulu, listen, yeah. I can't, mate. So, this was kind of shit. This is a shit already. Because you've got no money to spend. 
Doherty, you are not starting. So the team we're going to have to go with is Bergwijn, has Bergwijn through in the middle. Davis and Sanchez. Now, do I put Sanchez in over Davis? Tanganga as well. You know what? I will. You know what? Let's make the most of what we've got to deal with. Let's make the most. Right, let's just work with what we got. We'll make him a centre back. Never mind. We'll convert him to a left back. So, this is the team I'm going to have to go with. Unless I can pull off some crazy transfer. Bale's gone to Brighton. Ericsson cost us 25. We're not got enough for Madison. We've got 27 mil. I might just try and get players sold. We're going to play this game against Man City. Oh, oh yeah, by the way, we lost the semi-finals in the pre-season tournament. Two football clubs who are always determined to do things their own way. Tottenham and Manchester in real City. life, we beat City twice. So, yeah. And as well, guys, in fact, with this career mode, what I will be looking to do is win everything. Like, Shadow FC, our players might start to slow down as we, like, Try and get through this first season of the Tottenham career mode, but um, this is the scene here at the it won't. In London. We'll be going to win. I want to try and go the full 15 seasons on that. I've never gone 15 seasons in a career mode before, so we'll go with this. This will just try and win every trophy possible, and then we can pack it up. Well, then we can. Minimum target is to win everything. Well, the atmosphere is incredible inside the stadium, Derek. There's Which, now that I'm thinking about it, we could do in literally two seasons. And what it might bring. It's been a long way if we win the league, Carabao Cup, FA Cup, Conference League. No, because... Um, no, never mind, because we have to win the pre-season tournament, Champions League, Europa League, FA Cup, Carabao Cup, Human Shield, Premier League. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come in so, to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt This about is a that. good team. We've got no sign in so far, but Benton Core coming into the team. So Kulewski sitting on the bench. The goalkeeper. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri Here in the centre of midfield. And the role of lone striker in this setup goes to Maximiliano Gomez. Who? Significant acreage for City to run into. Man City already on the attack here. Well, staying bit is blocked and there. The and we've got Take defending to do. Here goes Perret well, Emil Huibia. Hoibier. Here he goes, Huibia. Crosses it in. Lucas Moura! Well, to be blunt, misfiring with the header. He kind of ran into the back of Kane. Whoa, I nearly fell off my bed. Here's Cancelo. Well, Gabriel really Jesus, here, Silva. Because it's his long awaited debut coming up. What should we be looking for from him, Stuart? Romero, that was like god awful. They've had some problems at the back in recent years. So I think they just want someone they can depend on. In recent years, out. we... Go. Man City lead. 1-0. And... Only eight minutes in. Somehow Bentoncourt has got it. Here's Bergwijn. Human Son. Good tackle. Maximiliano Gomez. Here we go. Real can't keep it. And it's Gabriel, Gabriel Jesus. Jesus. He made it look Lucas simple, Mora. Really. Stephen Bergwijn. Benton Core. Kane. Kane. Benton Core. Here's Mora. Looking for the goal. 
and Lucas Moura denied. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Maximiliano Gomez. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel I don't Jesus. know why he's, I said his name like that. Gabriel Jesus. Looking to cross it. Crossing ball. it. Gomez. Really can't get it. Lloris oh, with a brilliant with save. And we needed that to be saved. Put Kevin De Bruyne. And, and that's over the control, bar now. But still he'll be a bit disappointed. And that pass needed that to be a shit. lot more precise. Gomez. De Bruyne. He's, he's going to try and shoot, the but he's dispossessed at the last minute. Here's Emerson. And it's on the wing, but Lucas Moura, for some reason, because he's quick, he's offside. I don't think FIFA knows the offside rule. Well, it's a good tackle, but... Joao Cancelo. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can Here's Christian Romero, Emerson Royale. Not to be what was that? The away there. We'll put, getting box on, shot. At the race, penalty for some reason. Given. Emerson well, Royale's card, given away a penalty. And a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. Oh, Why come on. Is right here? He's walked, he's Let's ran into him. And De Bruyne has converted, and it's 2-0 to City. Come on. That's never a penalty. Here's Harry Kane. Awful from Harry Kane. And now we have to defend again. Here's Kyle Walker. Kevin De Bruyne. Americ Laporte. Bernardo Silva. Jao Cancelo, oh, Gabriel Jesus, and just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. Here's Lucas. Mora, can we go all the way? Lucas Mora. Not a great pass. It's given straight to Stephen Bergwijn. Here's Hoybier. Terrible, not enough on that ball to get through to Son. And Son's not able to get there. Silva. Maybe if I slid with Mora, he might have got there. I don't know. Over the top, I can't see Sterling. properly. There. I can't see the ball properly. I can't see the ball properly. I can't see the ball! Free for work. This out. What? I'm spamming circle, but the ball's not on the screen. It's three nil. Come on. The moment the ball gets shifted to that left hand side, I can't see it. I physically can't see because it's bright. To get it out of there. Gabriel Jesus. The ball. Gabriel I can't see the ball again. Flag up, tight offside. Ah. Intense pressure. Extremely I swear this game's position. rigged against you when you play against a team like Man City. I mean, like, come on, what is this? I go for the pass. Can you please? Yeah, look. I go for the pass. That's not where I aim. That's not where I point my stick. And as well, if it's going over there, then why is it locking to the player in the complete... Like, the player nowhere near it? I swear FIFA is just against you this year. Really getting stuck in defensively. Right. You could talk about scripting in the previous few FIFAs, but script, the scripting right, the here is just ridiculous. Right, FIFA has an agenda against its players. And he favours the inside routes. Superb block. Right, we're just paying 80 quid a year 
50 quid a year for a game that is completely unbalanced and rigged against you. And as well, next gen, yeah, meant to be best. I dread to think what old gen FIFA 22 is like. Because this is this the high promotion technology clearly non existent. Because what is realistic about the way these players are moving? Here's Lucas. Putting it backwards. Right, look. If it really, if they really did recreate how players would attack goals, someone wouldn't move backwards. He would have gone forward. The moment I press circle. Here's Mora. Oh, referee. And as well, the added time is awful. Ten seconds. Well, I say ten seconds before. Wait. Oh, I didn't even get to see it. So back in business with City very much but it's like, Can they as well, the when you're in added line. time, if Man C if that was Man City who won the ball then, they would have got another attack. And the amount of times I've spammed Triangle there to play okay. Son through, and he's just stood there and froze. Rodney. It's like, mate, it's not difficult. Just do the things I press. Just do the things I want you to do. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Gabriel Jesus. And now Rodri. Determined defending. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Can he finish? One block after another. Right, FIFA, you know tackling means you go for the ball. You don't just stamp well, out at a player and you don't just lean the and they hope for the best well, certainly a lot of focus on the boy over the last year or two and but look what is this circle Ap what right genuinely what is this tackling i'm convinced ea have never watched a game of football in their life i'm convinced high promotion technology is just non-existent Right, look, that is a full, that is, like, full bar, like, full power shot, not a toe poke, that's like, it's like he's kissed the ball to the goalkeeper. That is what that is. He's lipsed the ball instead of kicking it. Every pass hitting its target. Input delay. Love to see the input delay. Right, say what you want about eFootball. But at least it's not rigged. Like, look at that. A throw ball is not meant to bobble and move as slow as possible. It's meant to, you know, go through to a player. And passing as well. Why is he doing 360s with his foot? I pressed X like seven minutes ago. Romero. Look, what is that? He's behind him and he's taken a touch. High promotion technology, yeah? Realistic gameplay. Mate, FIFA 23, honestly, even better be good. Failed to keep hold of it. Right, say what you want about create a club, but in the physics in create a club. Look at that. Gabriel Jesus. He takes aim. And as well. I haven't seen one realistic thing from this game all year. Let's see about the delivery. Effort, I've got to take Man City have actually scored at the, uh, at the Spurs stadium. In real life, they haven't scored a single goal in the Tottenham stadium in the league, let alone won a game. Here's Kulievsky. In real life, he scored against these in his first ever start. It's played in, Kane swinging at it, but oh, he's offside because his shoelace was off. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. He is, he's onside. He's actually onside. He's actually onside. That's the funny thing. 
Like, there was no part of him offside. The red line was on top of the blue one. He's onside. Don't forget, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester City. Oh, Derek, big moment oh realistic. Yeah, realistic kick. Dejan Kulusevski. Well, possibilities inside the box. Unable to like, look at that. He's moved that out of the way of the ball. Right, mate, if you didn't turn your body and just lifted your foot up, that ball, that would be in the net by now. Just 15 minutes remaining. But no, Man City or Man City. Even Man City have even paid off the FIFA officials. And winning titles in FIFA doesn't even mean anything. Right, for God's sake. Gundogan. Sterling has it. Sterling. Not out of the woods yet. You know, don't make a slight. Don't make. Don't. Don't get a foot to the like. Go nowhere near the ball. Yeah, I know what's wrong. Whose idea was it? Who sat there in the EA board meeting, ways to improve slide tackling in FIFA, oh, like tackling in FIFA? Oh yeah, let's make them go nowhere near the ball when they make a challenge. Love that idea. That will make it realistic. Yeah, if you're Harry Maguire. Come on. And it's not like you can say either, oh, Tottenham would lose to Man City. If they played tomorrow, we beat them twice. And, the referee has got to and have a big think about it. we beat them twice this season. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Space and time for the cross. It's looking promising. Can they stop it going in? That shot as well. well if Edison was now. any other goalkeeper, that would have gone in. He's bloody chipped it. Palmer. He got good connect. Oh god, that's a uh, voice crack, isn't Silver. it? I don't know why I'm still playing this game. Right. Chance to run at them. Can he play it in? That's a foul. That starts up. That's a red card. Yep, Walker's been sent off. It won't mean anything. We're going to play it short here. Not to him. Why would you pass it like that to a player in the... Oh, my God. Realistic here, EA. Most realistic FIFA yet, apparently. Nah. Ne on next gen as well. Next gen. And the game's doing things like that. Right. What is this? Like, eFootball has better ball physics than this. And eFootball looks like it was invented on a toaster from 1847. They didn't even have toasters back then. I could get a group of, like, 11 two-year-olds to invent a football game and then come up with better physics than this. They're two. The scouting as well is just awful. Right. Genuinely. I need offers for players. That was some bog off. You know what? I'm going to transfer this to him. Um, Hoibio transfer list as well. Came up with your waffles. No, thank you. I'm going to do that. I'm going to sim this game against Wolves because I swear to God. We won in the 81st minute. Like, come on. Come on. It's taking me to a press conference. Yeah, no, good. What do you mean? Bergwijn, shut up. I need a cam. Wait, genuinely. 
Davison Sanchez to Leicester for 20 mil. I will accept that. Is that Doherty? Yeah. I'll take, I'll accept that. Two. Sanchez sold. Hoybia transfer offer from Man United. Let's try and get more out of that. I want. I'm already wanting to sell him because he's um, got what's it called? Because he's. What am I trying to say? I'm trying to sell him because I can get a lot for him, and I'm kind of needing transfer budget. Right. Right, let's see how much James Matt. 34. Ericsson can cost us 25. Do we bring back Ericsson? Or do we go for someone new? Right, what do we do in this situation? Uh, do we go for... We could go for Jesse Lingard. He's been linked with Tottenham. He was linked with us in... Um, the January transfer window, but do I don't have time to wait for. Can we loan him? No. Right, we're gonna have to try and buy Jesse Lingard without knowing anything about him. I don't pay too much, so I'll go with fifteen mil. They'll accept it. I'll probably over. I'm probably overpaying, but. I need Jesse. I need a cow. I need a attacking midfielder. We'll go crucial because he's gonna be the. He wants rotation. Mate, you're gonna be the only attacking midfielder in the team. You're gonna be playing a lot. Two year deal, fine. Fine. And actually, this could work out for us because then Man United will want um, Hoybier more, so might pay us more money. He's 79 rated. You know, that's not that's not bad. That's, that's not the best, uh, worst midfielder we've got. That's completely fine. Jesse Lingard, welcome to Tottenham Hotspur. As that Donny said. But yeah, welcome, Jesse Lingard, to Tottenham. Welcome to hell. You play Watford now, Jesse Lingard's debut. And, whoa, we're... Watford are ninth. <laughs> After two Our games. Lens, trained on one man. Amid rumours that he's leaving the club. Mate, he don't care. Today, live I'm going to skip TV. the kick-off. Well, Why are we focusing on Hoybier going to United? When we literally, out of nowhere, signed Ray Jesse Lingard. For 15 mil. If you, West like, last season, you would be called Robson. crazy for only 15 mil. Because of the form he was in. We could have had a penalty there. Uh, I think he just got the ball. He got the ball. You heard the ball. Lingard with number 13, I just realised. Probably because I didn't check the number. Dyer, his regular. Some with a good touch, but. He's been done there. Here we go. Is Jesse Lingard playing it through to Pierre Emil Hoybier? Mora oh, and Lucas Mora gives us the lead. Jesse Lingard with an assist on his debut. I probably could have shot with him. Was that Lingard or Hoybier? Well, Let's see. Well There's Hoybier. Hoybier. I was trying to cross it to Jesse Lingard, but it went to Mora, and I was like, fine. Mora, wallop it. Seven minutes in, our number 27 has given us a one. Has given us the lead. One nil. Come on, lads. Comes to nothing in the that down and here's Harry Kane and we could move on here Defensive and that's a good challenge to get the ball back and so is that and Benton call Jesse Lingard a Spurs free kick has won us a foul Romero we're going to play it short to Benton core 
who just gets the pass off. Benton Kaur, Kane. Harry Kane. Lingard. Here's Lingard. Jesse Lingard. Could go all the way, Lingard. Straight up Foster. Could have been. I'm trying to get the pass to Jesse Lingard, but it didn't want to make the run. That who that was awful. And good challenge, Hoybier. Perry Emil Hoybier. I was waiting for Kane to hurry up and get in the box oh, to shift it, but it's a bit of a delayed reaction. And here's Kane. Lingard with a great touch. Jesse Lingard saved by Foster. And here's Lucas Mora. What was that shot? That was a shot. What happened there? Mate, you could score on the volley, but you can't score there. And possibilities here's here. Dennis and he's it. dispossessed by Hoybier. Maybe I shouldn't be trying to get rid of Hoybier. He's having a game yes. of his life. Mora. Now Harry Kane. Here's Kane. Will he find the net? Kane! Fingertips from Ben Foster. Ben Foster's having the game of his life Can as well. Son crossing it in, looking for Lingard! And it's not the greatest attempt in the world, is it? Oh, but it's given away. Lingard can't slip Harry Kane through. By the way, international job offers are on. And usually with a Tottenham career mode, as you know, I do take the England job. So will we take Gareth Southgate's place before England win a World Cup or a Euro? Shot, deflected away, shot again, well, this is going to be a pen, is it a pen or is it a free kick? Position. It's a free kick and it could be a card maybe, I don't think so, no it's not a card, no yellow card, just a talking to, he's going to pass it off but watch him shoot, oh, a it's a good save by Hugo Lloris. And well, Lucas Moura, that's a great ball to him. It's only a of time if they keep Moura with good feet. Lucas Moura. Trying to pass it back. And, and maybe I should have shot or maybe I should have passed the ball sooner. And we've won the ball back. Jesse Lingard well, again. No and here's Kane. Kane. Oh, I went to pass to it to Lucas. But it's fine. Son's corner played in. Looking for Dyer. Here's Lucas Mora. Jesse Lingard. Lingard! Saved again by Foster. And here's Harry Kane coming again. Lingard! Penalty? Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. forward. Right, I think we we're can't head of it. We can't get it to Benton Core. But more. Lucas Moura has won the challenge. The score's level again now at 1 1 with first. Chances on. Lucas! Saved again well, by Foster. Say, that's goalkeeping at its very best. Ben Foster is having the game of his career. And then goes! Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Well, to Alex, apologies for having to interrupt you just then. To confirm, Burnley have scored in that Lingard. match. And the match is level at 1-1. Moving it forward again. That's out for a goal kick. Emerson Royale. On the verge of the interval, it's Here's so Lucas Moura. So Stuart, interested to get your thoughts. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. Somehow we... Well, oh, we've got it back. Here's Lingard. It's been a solid performance so far. Oh, 
and it's over the top. Hugo Lloris. Here's Regulon. Lingard. Here's Lucas Mora for his brace. Lucas Mora puts us 2 0 up, and Jesse Lingard with an assist, I think that was. Was that a Lingard assist? Well, here it is again, and the pace in yeah, which that's a Jesse Lingard assist. He was screaming so for it, but he was never going to catch up to the defender. So Mora goes all the way, and it is 2 0 at the break for the boys. Come on, lads. Lingard was definitely the right option. And if we sell so Hoybier, yeah, maybe we could go in for an Ericsson or maybe defend, depending on how much he goes for, James Madison. And I think if we win something this season as well, we're going to get a lot more money next season. So we could be doing a lot of mad movements next season. Making Son's away, Kim in Son, he's going to come cut back here, Son! Really and really Foster recovery. holding on to it. We still do need to kill the game off. Regulon. Well, certainly a lot of focus on the boy Here's the Kane. And he seems to have a Harry Kane. Hopefully it turns out to be a good move and he can continue to develop And his career. not much able to happen there with Harry Kane's pass. Well, let's see what His they have Saar. Dennis trying to cross it in. Hernandez is free. Hernandez gets his head to it. And that is an awful header. We'll bring Harry Winks on. And this could be... His last ever game for the club. He's wave is clapping himself off, waving goodbye to possibly waving goodbye to the Spurs fans. And providing width, he's in here. Mora, Harry Kane, Kane for three. Lingard. Cleared away comprehensively. So. Well, no letter, plenty of pressure. A foul, but advantage that played. was a foul from Son, I can't Even lie. Sar in possession. Can we dispossess them? Good challenge, Romero. Here's well, Harry Winks. Winks. And we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Crystal Palace. We'll Harry Winks. Winks! Oh, Harry Winks! Harry Winks off the bench has scored and what a run from the lad. Look at this. What a run, Harry Winks. Well, as you can see, he gets a bit lucky here. The deflection just Boom. had the keeper wrong Shot. Footing, but he won't and worry it about did that. take a deflection and will that be an own goal? No, Harry Winks does get the credit. And it's out here, Jesse Lingard. Well, there it is. Spurs have controlled the possession. What yes, a ball to Son. Well Son. Forward, Harry Kane, if he just didn't ball, move just them so hard to wide, here, then that ball would have got to him. And Lingard so winning far. it back. Here's Benton Core. Lucas Mora. That, what, that. Uh, 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 that's, um. Who have you picked and out there then, Lucas? Change. You know what? I can't be bothered. 3-0, the final score, and, well, we'll uh, Watford in the mud. But anyway, guys, next episode we will have the deadline day, and Hoybier will be staying. 
But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed the video, then make sure to smash the like button. If you, oh god, if you're new around here, subscribe and tap that notification bell to never miss a video. And sure the subscribe squad, guys. Of course, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. See you guys. Um, what's the button? Peace out.